You need to stick up for yourself, Melvin. Welcome back, welcome back to K Time TV. This is a special program called Ask Aunt Crystal. Now, this lady behind me, she's a very, very special young lady. Get me? She looks good as well. Job well done. Get me? Well, well, well done. You look good. Yay! <laughs> so, this is going to be a program where we're going to be answering some questions or you might have some questions for her and she she's a very good speaker herself she's very knowledgeable and i respect her a lot so being a good gym instructor what i'm going to ask her is a couple of questions which may benefit some of you young ladies out there to look oh, good for the beach and that hey <laughs> you get me come on all right the first question which i want to ask you yeah. myself is what is the best tip you can give someone if they want to tone up Hmm, that is a very tricky question um, because we have to get into this thing about toning up. Um, okay, I don't want to get too deep, you know, I, I don't, I don't want to, you know, be proper going into this. But okay, so toning up is a word that we use. There's no such thing as toning up. Mm. Like there's actually no such thing as toning up. Mm. Okay, so when people talk about toning up, a lot of the times they feel as though, you know, that it might be turning their fat into muscle. Um, no, fat never turns into muscle. Ever. Ever. <laughs> ever. Ever. <laughs> okay. Never. It doesn't just doesn't happen. Yeah. Right? Um, and also, so when you're talking about toning up, I think a lot of people, they're either talking about increasing, you know, their muscles mm -hmm. or they're talking about reducing their body fat. That, okay, that that's, that's 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 the only thing that they can actually be be talking about and like w even i use the word toning up because yeah. sometimes you know i don't have time to explain you know everything so i'll just say you know someone says oh yeah this is good for toning up and i'll be like yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah yes it is <laughs> yeah yeah this this will get you toned up because i know what they mean okay I okay see, so see. i'm not like deliberately trying to mislead them mm. but i know what they mean okay no. <laughs> 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 stop now. Okay. But um but okay, so advice. First of all, I can't just give one bit of advice because you know there's different different types of people, different you know, there's different there might be someone who's overweight who, you know, needs to lose some body fat. There might be someone who's not overweight but they don't have the muscle tone that they want yeah. and they want to build up that muscle tone so that it's you know that they have a little bit more definition mm -hmm. um i believe that most people definitely know what it takes when it comes to the nutrition side of things yeah, yeah they might not be a nutritionist they might not be an expert but most people with common sense they know deep down in their heart of hearts they know what they should and shouldn't be eating Right. You know what it just reminded me? Well, Deep down <laughs> in my heart, <laughs> I still love you. <laughs> Somewhere deep down in my heart, I still love you. Okay, so basically, no, but I really truly believe that people do, you know, people know what it, what it, what they should and shouldn't be eating. Mm -hmm. They are in denial, you know, they feel as though they can, they, they can pretend like they don't know and they need to go and see a specialist or a professional. No, you don't. You know, you know, first of all, processed food, try and cut out as many processed food as you can. Mm -hmm. Um... White, white is bad. Mm -hmm. No white sugar, white pasta, white bread. Try and cut it out as much as you can, yeah. you know. Um, and try to c cook things yourself. I know everyone's not 
Gordon Ramsay out here, but <laughs> I am. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Yeah, all on. right, Ainsley. All right, Ainsley. <laughs> but I know everyone's not Gordon Ramsay out here. But try and cook your own food because then you know exactly what's going in it. Yeah. You know, and um, these fad diets, they are all just ridiculous. I don't believe in um, any sort of diet that requires you to miss meals, replace see, meals, yes, 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 anything yes, yes, like yes. that. I don't believe in things like that because the reason I don't believe in it is because I'm not saying that you won't get results. Yeah. You will get results, but long term, it's, it's not ideal. Yeah. It's not ideal long term because you can't do it forever. Mm-hmm. So when it comes to what you're eating, I would say you want to make small lifestyle changes that you can keep forever instead of trying to do one of those crazy like crash that. diets like for, for, for a couple of weeks or months mm. or whatever, you lose a few pounds, and then as soon as you start eating again, you're like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it just all comes you're back on again. Yeah. <laughs> like Nutty Professor. You know <laughs> Nutty <laughs> Professor when his foot blows up? <laughs> That's what happens when you do those stupid diets. Right? <laughs> I swear down. Like, so, you know, I'm not saying, you know, you can't do it. I'm not saying don't do it, but in my opinion, yeah. and you know, from what I've seen, they don't work for the long term. It's mm-hmm. not a long term solution. Mm-hmm. So I suppose there's, you know, a few different, uh, quite a few different tips in there. Mm-hmm. You know, um, you know, watch what you're eating. You know what you should and shouldn't be eating. Cool. Stay away from processed food. Try and know exactly what you're eating. Mm-hmm. Stay away from these diets. And of course, exercise. You know, you have to exercise. Like. You can have a great diet and not exercise. And hey, I'm not saying that you won't get results, but you're not going to be looking, you know, in tip top shape. Come on. You're not going to be, you're not going to have that beach body that, that you want. That beach thing. You're not going oh. to have that beach body that you nah. want. And you know what? It's vice versa as well. You can work out, but if you're not watching you know. what you're eating oh. properly, then same again. Like, you're just kind of wasting your time really well not wasting your time because obviously it does still benefit you but like why go to the gym work yeah. out and then ruin it all by eating Eat shit and you know missing out on being able to have a, a banging ass body you get me yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you heard it for yourself you heard it for yourself i myself want to say thank you Cause that's that's definitely helped me. Anytime, you know. Anytime, I mean? Mel, Mel. Anytime. I don't know if he's told you, but he he uh, he also goes by another name. Toby. No, 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 no. Don't listen to that. Don't listen to that. Don't listen to that. Toby. Thank you, thank you very much that's for watching much, this. <laughs> if you have any more questions or you want Aunt Crystal to answer any of your questions, comment below and I will again. Come on, man. I'm the best new, okay, news reporter right. about. I will find anything you want to find. And at the same time, she has her own YouTube channel and she promotes, well, she shows all her videos of exercises and stuff. Follow her. I'll put the link behind us. Oh, underneath, not behind. That'll be that way. Underneath. <laughs> if you click on that, you'll get ideas of what certain exercises to do, you know, to get that. That. Let me. Oh, I've got a little wedgie. You always got a wedgie. <laughs> What do you mean? Oh, come on. Anyway, thank you for watching, guys. And make sure you tune in next time. <laughs>